So if you can see me properly, and yes, uh, it's morning 4:30. Yes, I didn't shoot because I was depressed because I was actually late, and uh, yeah, I was late for dinner. And later on, I didn't feel like because I was feeling drowsy, sleepy. No, last night we didn't sleep well. So yeah, if you can see us properly, this is the one. Back side is our coach. We are going for hot air balloon. Then we will be going to a reef. Then uh, there will be snorkeling and everything. I think this bus is loading everyone, like uh, Indians as well as other con uh, uh, different country, different country people also. I don't know which country they are. Uh, yeah, it's getting loaded. And we'll take an hour to reach over there. So from there we will do the hot table. After that, after hot table, we'll be going to the reef. That's it. So let's go. Let's head and see what's there. Site, please observe and be aware that there are areas that you're not permitted to stand. These are called no-go zones. Has anyone been on a night dive last night? Hot air would advise against going up in a balloon. There must be at least 12 hours delay between your last dive and going up in any balloon. Please contact your driver when the bus stops if this does apply to you. Ballooning is a wonderful experience you will never forget. So to ensure your entire morning is smooth, please listen to the following instructions. This morning your balloon will be doing two flights. If you're booked on for half an hour, you can be on first flight or second flight. We have gas. Sorry about traffic. This is Peter Balloon Romeo Uniform Whiskey. Launching at this time. You know, they are free for what I'm trying to do.
Chulan over here. It's area over here. So now, please, I need your cameras in your pockets. Now, yes, please. So finally we are done with the, with the hot air balloon and yeah this is the car which towed this one we are sitting on a sideways and that's why we landed over there now we are getting on the bus and yeah that's the bus over there which will take to our main bus which is the car land cruiser got a land cruiser huge car man huge car see the car see the ground clearance it's huge We actually went up to 2,000 feet, yeah, 2,000, 3,000, up to 3,000, 2,700 is legal, so we went up to that. So now we are heading for, I think, breakfast or something, yeah. Come on, let's go. So guys, finally, after one hour, one and a half hour, we reached this place, and this is the bus point, and right over there, we are getting into a boat, and this one hotel over here, on this side, and... There's a lot of crowds over here, as you can see. Inside there's uh, tickets, I guess. They're waiting for tickets. Yeah, inside that's it. Very crowded. See this place? It's boat, yacht everywhere. Lots of crowd, man. Lots of, uh, you know, Americans or British or some other people are from Australians. Or everyone, uh, everyone is mixed. I think most Australians. In fact, so yeah, we are not late. As you can see, that's it. So yeah, so at 9 o'clock, sharp 9, the boat will leave. And it's almost around 8.41. Mm. 8.41 is the time. And people are still waiting. There's a lot of people waiting on the street. Right? A lot of people waiting. Yeah, don't worry. <laughs> okay, finally got a ticket. This is a ticket, and here is lunch. We're getting in like this. There's a queue over here. Like this, they get in. That's how the boat looks like. This is the one. Uh, yes. And that is the way we came in. This is the way that this is came. And that's that's a, a hotel or something. I don't know. It's a hotel. Yes, must be a hotel. And this is a cruise. This is the one. We're getting in like this. And, yeah. So another 10, uh, 10 15 minutes to go. Boots are getting ready. And yeah. Our cruise. We're going to terrace right now. Steps. This is the inside part which people are sitting in right here. This is the inside part people are sitting in. And we are heading out. Heading out as we are going to terrace, not heading out. the condition is right now and yeah people have fun this is the end part i hope i've shown you the boat enough because lots of people around they won't feel like comfortable when shooting like this and yeah that's all about it
That's all right. I'm in the way, the bridging is not clean and won't be doing because I'm not swimming. Uh, it's not allowed to do snorkeling. I'll be doing a submarine thing, mini submarine. Mini submarine thing will be doing, so that's fine. And otherwise, anyways, you can chill near the beach. Have fun. That's all. That's all for now. And yeah, it was a pretty sunny ride. You can see the backside. Okay, we are just almost there. See? So almost I mean, I can't see it's so so bright over here, I can't see. I should have my sunglasses. Anyways. So yes guys, so this is the spot. As you can see that yeah. That's how deep it is. That's how deep it is. It's nothing. But anyways, uh So it's like what is time? 10, 40, 9, 50. I think 11, 11, 15 we have to come back. Yes. That's one more boat over there. Lots of people over here. Lots of people over there. All are snorkeling. You see? Yeah. Snorkeling people. So this is what the depth is right now. Right now time is what 138. And I'm not going very deep because I'm not good at swimming and all that. I took a very bad chance. Chance here. Yeah. Took my phone out of this Hypex waterproof cover. I'm just walking like this and there's water at this level. Anything happens, it's down or somewhere. My phone drops into the water and it's gone. It'll be gone. Drop into the water and we gone. So yeah, so let's just put this thing in it and try to walk as far as I can. That far is very deep. And this is where it's, everything is getting started. Because the bridge over there is just connecting to the, yeah, that's the boat over there. I'll try to put this thing inside the water so let this go inside. So guys, this is a mini submarine right now. We're getting it with a mini submarine, yeah. So let's get it. Is the largest reef structure in the world. In fact, it is visible from the moon. The only other structure on Earth. Just above your head, there is your life jacket. It is so large that astronauts can see it from space. The Great Barrier Reef is home to an amazing number of fish, coral, shells, crabs, and other marine life. It is an hour. They're called giant trevelli or trevelis. The little ones with the yellow tails, they're called yellow-tailed fusiliers. 
And then the silver ones with the blue flecks down their scales, they're called Spangled Emperors. Well, they have an amazing camouflage. They look like a leaf floating around in the debris. They then make their way out to the Great Barrier Reef where they'll spend the rest of their lives and mature into the fish that you see today. Finally, it's time for the lunch, guys. We have a lot, a lot of lunch over here. There is a crowd, too much of a crowd down here. And we have to get in the line. Let's see what happens next. So guys, finally we are done with uh, all diving thing, swimming, diving, everything, swimming, and snorkeling, and that boat and everything, uh, glass boat. I actually did till this part, see it down, yeah, I actually did till this part, which was pretty good, yeah, it's pretty good, my dad helped me do the snorkeling because I'm not good with swimming and all that, so it's more of a, cur more of a current over here. It's written over there, we have to be careful. So anyways, we will be leaving in around 10 minutes from now. Uh, for that... Uh, for cons. Yeah, so when I stay... Then... No, we are, we are staying in uh, cons. So, same same routine. Uh, evening. Uh, evening that, uh, that is... Uh, yeah. Dinner is there around 7, 7.30, 7.30, 7.30, 8.00, dinner is there. So again, tomorrow morning, Melbourne flight. That's it for now. And same thing, nothing, nothing much to show. That's it. So guys, we are trying to get to this uh, drive through and there was a, one car over there. We wanted to actually order from there, like by walking. And he is the one, his idea. So a lot of cars are coming, so we dropped our plan. So I don't know what to do now. So guys, we are crossing through a street and we have spotted this bikes over here. This is the one uh, Honda 650F. Sorry for this. 500X. We don't have in India. So yeah, he is the one. This is the one something three CB 300F. We don't have it in India. This is the one. It's the best one. Matte black. It's a 500R CBR. CBR 500. If you can see properly. So we are heading to the hotel. Bye bye. So today is the end of everything and the time is right now 8.20. This is how the street looks like. As you can see it's written over here. Spencer Street Khan's Regional Council. Yeah, Spencer Street. And there is an Indian hotel over there. Tandoor House. One second, I forgot. Because I was not hungry. One second, I'll read for you. Tandoor something. Tandoor oven guys, Tandoor oven. So yeah, and this is how the street looks like. It's all closed right now because uh, it's 7, 8.20 right now. That's where the party is going on. Okay. There's a party going on the rooftop. rooftop. There's a party going on. So anyways, tomorrow we're going to Melbourne from here, from Cannes. It will take 4 hours of time. So yeah, we'll uh, see you at Melbourne.